everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a first impression review on a liquid lipstick. And as you can see from the title, alam niyo na ako ano ite. It is the Pinkies Collections. Ano ba ngalan nito? Actually, it's called the Long Lasting Lip Gloss. Pero nutinray ko siya on the back of my hand. Um, nakita ko na it's actually a liquid lipstick. Like it's a matte liquid lipstick, not a la la, not a lip gloss whatsoever. So. Liquid lipstick siya guys. Matte liquid lipstick. Hindi siya lip gloss, ha? Yung shade na to na nakuha ko is in spicy. Yeah, spicy. I just chose the red shade kasi wala lang. Para wala pa siya akong red liquid lipstick in my collection and I wanted to get one. So, ito. Spicy. <laughs> Ganito lang yung packaging niya. Very simple. Clear lang siya dito so makikita mo yung actual lip color. Then yung kanita clip is a nice pink, like a light pink color. Tapos may sulat na Pinkies Collections right there. Dito pala sa baba yung ano, shade name niya na spicy. Then ang sulat din dito sa kanya yung packaging that it is made in France. That makes it seem fancy. Tapos it is good 12 months after opening. Ah! I bought this for 225 pesos sa Watson. So, I think that's a pretty good deal. Medyo mas mahal siya na konti dun sa Everbelena. By the way, wala pa ako nabibili dun sa Everbelena LTD liquid lipsticks kasi wala pa dito sa SM malapit sa amin. Meron dun sa city pero hindi pa ako nakakapunta dun. So, <laughs> pasensya na. Okay, let's go ahead and open this up para masimula na natin ang ating first impressions. Ang ganda ng kulay, red na red. I love it. I'm excited. Okay, nakita ko naman dun sa ano, dun sa stall nila sa SM na marami silang colors available. Meron akong lip balm on my lips kasi I always apply lip balm before I apply my face makeup. Naging habit ko na lang talaga yun, but tatanggalin ko siya. Medyo may konting dryness din na sa aking lips dito sa bottom left. Bottom left ko, bottom right nyo. Dito na part, medyo dry yung lips ko. So, tignan natin how this performs on medyo dry na lips. Alright, so tignan muna natin yung kanyang applicator. Ayan, simple doe foot applicator lang siya. Tapos super short lang na applicator as you can see. And yung scent niya. Ooh, smells bad. Ang baho. Bakit yun naman mabaho siya? Mabaho siya. Ano pang amoy nito? Parang amoy insecticide, parang ganun. Ang baho, parang amoy chemically. Super, super chemically nung amoy niya, which is not good. Pero let's go ahead and apply this on the lips. Tignan natin how it performs. Ooh, super pigmented. Okay, so ayan yung initial application ko. One coat lang yan. And one dip lang para sa aking lower lip. Okay siya. Madali lang siyang i-apply using this itty bitty doe foot applicator. And so far pigmented naman at hindi siya nagsiskip. No skipping whatsoever. And super pigmented niya. It doesn't look patchy whatsoever. I like it. Okay. Apply natin siya on the upper lip. Hindi pa ako bumabalik sa tube. So, try natin siya. Okay, ayan siya may upper lip. I think I need to go back in the tube kasi parang dito na part hindi na siya ganun ka-rich yung color niya. So, I needed to go back inside the tube. Apply natin siya dito. Now I remember why I don't have a red liquid lipstick. Kasi mahirap siya apply Okay, I just need to <laughs> fix this up with some concealer kasi tignan niyo parang dumi na tignan. So, babalik ako. Wait lang. I just need to clean this up with concealer. Alright guys, so it's probably um, two minutes later and ito na yung best na magagawa ko na lipstick application. <laughs> I do apologize kung hindi siya pasado sa inyong standards but ayan, it's been about two minutes and this is how it looks like on my lips. Parang na talaga siyang liquid lipstick and it kind of feels like the... It doesn't feel like my Jazzy Friends Lustrous Lip Gloss. Parang same siya ng feeling ng Colourpop. Medyo drying, tapos 
Super matte lips. Ganun yung itsura niya. Oh, ganun yung feeling niya. Tapos, looking at it right now, na siguro nag-set na siya, it does look a little bit patchy sa aking lower lip. Pero sa upper lip, super obvious talaga na medyo patchy talaga siya tignan. But, yun. Siguro, that's my fault sa aking application sa upper lip. Siguro, I had to go back inside the tube to get a little bit more product para ilagay sa upper lip. So, yun. Pero ngayon, nagustuhan ko naman siya. Okay naman siya sa aking lips. It doesn't feel drying at all. Like, Parang wala lang akong suot sa aking lips. Except siguro kapag I lick my lips, definitely mapifeel ko siya sa aking lips na medyo dry substance doon. Pero kung wala akong kinagawa sa lips ko, like, ganito talaga, sasalita lang ako, parang wala lang siya sa aking lips. Like, I don't feel anything at all. Tapos, itry natin kung kiss-proof ba siya. Kiss-proof, bongga. No transfer at all. No transfer! I like this. Okay. Mmm, bongga, I like this. Kung bongga to, for only 225 pesos, tapos bongga to, okay, pasado siya sa akin. Anyway, tignan natin kung drink-proof ba siya and eat-proof ba din siya. Like, I'll eat and drink all throughout the day, tapos babalik ako mamaya to let you know how this works out for me. It is, it is now 12.45pm, kakain ako ng lunch mamaya-maya, and I'll update you guys later how this works for me. Hey guys, mini check-in. It is now 3:05 p.m. Tignan niyo yung lips ko. Oh, nagbleed siya, guys. Oh, sa sides ng lips dito. Dito wala naman. Dito lang sa isang side nagbleed siya kaloka. Pero okay lang naman yung lips ko. Hindi naman totally need to retouch talaga. Pero dito nagbleed siya. And dito sa aking drink, tignan niyo yung straw. Nagtransfer yung lipstick ng konti. transfer siya. But yeah, yun ang aking mini check-in. Siguro aayusin ko ito. Pwede ko bang i-wipe? I-try ko ha. Um, probably need to fix that with some powder or concealer. Pero yun ang aking mini check-in. I'll get back to you guys later. Nanonood lang ako ng YouTube videos dito. Currently watching Charles Gross. <laughs> Sige, see you later! Ito yung nangyari nung kinis ko si Kenny. Yung outline lang ng aking lipstick ang nag-transfer. Hi, guys! Hi, <laughs> Yung outline lang ng lipstick ang nag-transfer. And this is how it looks like now. Hindi naman ako kumain. Eh, kumain ako ng saging. Saging. Tapos, naubos ko na yung juice. So, ayan na siya ngayon. Pangit na siya. Kailangan na mag-retouch. Pero, kakain kami mamay. Kasi, what time is it? 6.30 na. I just need to cook some rice. And we have some lechon manok! <laughs> hey guys, so, update. What time is it? <gasps> Wait lang. It is 7.47pm. So, mga 7 plus hours. And, tignan nyo ang situation na aking lips. Ang pangit na! Pangit ng hair ko. Wait lang. Let me fix it. Para maganda naman ako sa update na ito. Yeah, that's the best that I can do for my hair. Bet. Bet. But tinan nyo yung lipstick. Nag-blot ako ng aking face. Tapos tinan ko mag-blot din ng lipstick. And nakita nyo, hindi na siya kiss-proof, guys. Yung outer corners na tatanggal na siya. Let's try again. Tatanggal pa rin, oh. As you can see right there. So, after mong kumain, hindi na siya magiging kiss-proof. Okay naman sana siya kasi it's very lightweight. Um, parang wala ka lang lipstick na suot. Well, at least for me, yun yung feeling ko sa kanya. Tapos, very affordable pa siya and very readily available. Yung problema lang sa kanya is nagsasmudge siya outside the lip lines. Pero madali namang ayusin yan. You just need to apply a lip liner first. Pero, um, thinking na there are other brands na Siguro magiging same price lang if you purchase this and a lip liner. So, doon na lang sa ibang brands, ba? Para hindi ka na kailangan mag with a lip liner. Gusto ko lang gawin right now is I wanna try to reapply para makita natin kung okay la ba siyang ipatong over yung old liquid lipstick na pinagdaanan na ng whole day na kain and dinom and all that jazz.
Okay, so there you go. Pinatong pa lang siya over the pinagdaanan na ng holiday wear na lipstick. And, in my opinion, okay lang naman siya. Okay lang siya tignan. Parang same lang nung how we initially applied it. I like it. So, that's good. Madali lang naman siyang i-reapply. So, after mong kumain, madali lang siyang i-apply. Bongga. That's good. Kasi yung ibang liquid lipstick, kailangan mo siyang burahin lahat bago ka mag-reapply. So, this one, okay lang. Madali lang naman siyang gamitin. Siguro, kung ako yung papipiliin, siguro, I will not purchase this one again. Kasi nga nagbe-bleed siya outside the lip lines. And I'm not the type of person who really wears a lip liner first. I would much rather prefer yung Jazzy France Lustrous Lip Gloss or yung mga Colourpop na Ultra Matte Liquid Lipsticks. Kung gusto nyo ng matte liquid lipstick, yun ang mas bet kong gamitin. But yeah, yun na aking review for the Pinkies Collection Long Lasting Lip Gloss. Sana nakatulong itong review para sa inyo. If it was helpful, uh, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And also, you can subscribe to my channel. Just click the circle right there. And you can watch my last video somewhere over here. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and I hope to see you in the next one.